Let's rock! Good morning everyone. Here we are at the Australian Computer Museum in Sydney and today we're looking at our Nintendo Wii console that we've just uh, got running. This one is using a component video cable so we've got the 480p which should be about the best picture you're going to get out of a Wii and it's uh, scaled up on this TV to widescreen so it's not as sharp as it could be but I think that it's still going to look pretty nice. And to test it out, we've got Pandora's Tower. So it's not a very well-known game. That's one that I happen to have at home and I'm gonna donate it to the museum so that we've yeah. got a Wii game for testing. So let's pop the disc in and see how we go. Okay, our Wiimote is working here. You can see we've got the homebrew channel set up. Uh, this is something that was already on there when we got the Wii, so uh, I think if we get some files in SD card, maybe we can have a go at that later on. But for now... There we go. It's always kind of nice the way the, the Wii games have these little intro screens before you start them up in the menu there. So what is Pandora's Tower? Uh, I guess it's an action RPG. And uh, it's very anime styled. Uh, the idea is that this girl, a princess, I think, or a priestess or something, has been cursed. Um, she was bitten by a monster, I think, and so she's turning into a monster and she needs to eat monster hearts to restore her. Start a new game. Didn't go very far the first time. Just testing it out, really. Okay, we've got our usual, I guess, Final Fantasy style intro here. Some fancy costumes. People with oddly coloured hair. This is going to be quite long, so we can probably skip a bit of this and we'll come back in when the uh, important info starts to get dumped. Uh, okay, they didn't really explain why, but I, I guess she's when those bad guys showed up. I don't know what this thing is. It's like a skeleton pot guy that the witch carries around. Oh, she's so happy. <laughs> Okay, so we've got a fetch quest. Get beast flesh. Okay, we had 13 towers. This is treetop tower, so I guess that means 13 levels. Right, so I can run around with a little nunchuck. And hit that to do attacks. I can hold it down, do a charge attack. <clears throat> um, I can press this button to guard and sort of roll. 
Also, I can aim the Wii mode at things, and I can press the little trigger there to zoom in on stuff, which I think will become useful later on. Okay, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that that chain is important. I guess I need to find something to break the chain. Just go and smack it, that'd be too easy. Okay, now you may have noticed I didn't mention a jump button. Um, ooh, dry it. Pretty much what happens is just if I push towards this ledge, then the guy jumps up. Uh, now what else? Okay, really, I can shoot my little thingy at these boxes, that's kind of cool. Okay, so I can run around here, I can pick things up with my nunchuck. Now when I go to the edge, I uh, don't fall straight off, I can kind of jump along or then press that button to drop down. So, I don't think there's going to be heaps of platforming in this. I'm just going to go and smack all the crates, which is what you should do in every game. Ooh, oh, 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 if this guy's killing the bug, maybe he's my friend. Although I doubt it. Beast flesh. Mm. It's appetizing. I need to get back. Okay. go back to where I started. And I'm going to go to observatory, which is where I started. Easy game over. Hmm. 
In the heart of the continent of Imperia lies the kingdom of Illyria. At its remotest edge, hundreds of leagues from the capital of Helicon, a forbidding wasteland stretches to the furthest horizon. Ocanus. Deep within this desolate expanse, where none may set foot, the earth has been torn asunder to form a rift extending over thousands of leagues, known simply as the Scar. At its center, suspended above this fathomless fissure, are the Thirteen Towers. Towers of all sizes, interlinked and intertwined, each playing their part in the intricate design, fusing to become one single vast fortress. Held in place by twelve chains that grip the walls of the surrounding cliffs, the towers loom like a spider in its web, seeming to inhabit a space beyond the normal world. The bristling turrets of the towers serve a purpose. They bind the earth together, preventing the scar from widening and tearing the world itself apart. Stop there. to grab him with that chain and then I waggle the stick and it pulls it it's off. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's all the boots. Yeah, you can find him. You could 
buying him. Yeah. You can bind him and wreck him as if he was just a normal enemy. Mm. You can bind him and wreck him as if Now you can bind stuff and yeah. oh, it's so loud. Yeah, I pull them out of the ground. I think I can. Let's do this. Look. Okay. That's a dryer baby. Oh, so it looks a bit you look a bit damaged. What's the health? Mm -hmm. Try a berry. Mm -hmm. It mm -hmm. replenishes your health. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, what's that? Ah, oh, that's right. Alright. Find him, bind him, bind him so he can't do anything. Go, 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 go. Just try and can you dodge or something? Yeah. Uh now nah. When I say now dodge Dodge. Now. Now the other guy. I'm guessing you could probably sell them. Yeah. It kind of looks like you can sell them. Mm -hmm. Look at those books. Oh, it looks like I can do a jump, can I? Oh look, I can pull his sleeves up. I 
I think you just did it. I was like, rip the parts off that and stick the chain there and see what happens. Oh, I guess it's like when I hit that. <laughs> ah, there we go, I did it. Okay, cool. Alright. Okay, I guess now we They keep coming out. They come out of it. It's shadow. You've got these really got the strange brands. There's some use. Ah, you really need to help. Yeah. Kill them first. And pull off the dealies. Ah! Hit that dealie. Ah, what happened? That wasn't a chain. Oh, he just did it. Hey, can you see that head? Yeah. It's head, it's head. Okay. It's the head. Okay, the head, the head. Off. I hit the head. It's force, is it? Oh, really? Oh, okay, now I've changed these two go. Oh, okay, now I get it. You can chain things together. We got all the stuff. Get all the stuff. Get it. Get the head first. Oh, here we go. We've got dripping flesh. I think that's good. Okay. Is there, is there a quick exit? You should go through the door. See what's in the door. Let's smash chest. Smash those. That's an, it's another, it's another something. Oh, that's, that's one of those shooter things. They shoot at you. What's that you have? I don't know. Dawn Chorus, I think it's a flower. It's definitely a flower. Yeah. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Now it's in the now it's like any enemy. Right. <coughs> I think those are the ones that drop the dawn cores. Crystal water gushes from the fountain. It is sort of be soothing. Okay. Fast. Examine. Examine. There's no need to drink any water. Oh, okay. So it's like a healing. Pull the box and now grab the stuff. This, oh, what that cool. You can do with that. Maybe in the tower thing. Boop, boop. Other direction. I saw a hole in the wall. Can you go through there? No. Do you have a jump button? You no. can jump over the rock. You can't actually jump. You can do like rollers. Oh, here we go. Leap over gaps. <laughs> I guess you just auto jump. Can you see those? Oh, it's a 
silver coins. Wow, that's really good. Lots of the money. Can I put this in the With the chain? Like, with the items? Grab those, see what that, that does. Just hit one of the flowers, not big one of the as if you're ripping something out. What is that? What is just the chest? Oh, there's some kites over there for you to smash. Kites, there's some kites down there. There's a ladder. <laughs> oh, oh, a treasure chest. Chest. Can you examine? <coughs> the other is connected to the floor. To release chain so it smash the point of connection. Blah, blah, blah. Use our chain to grab the handle and open them. It's an orange, so that's what this do. Grab the handle and open them. Is this the handle? I think. I don't know what I'm supposed to do something with that. Maybe not. Maybe I'll go up here. Yeah, that's good. Oh, there's a. There's a chain thing. Shoot that. I think I can go up. That's pretty cool. So, without the nail? No. Oh, you might shoot the nail. I guess I'm getting closer to the chain room. Oh, here we go. <coughs> So that's like a, a timer. It's the um. Shoot! 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 This. Shoot that. Shoot it. Can you shoot it? No. It did it with the weapon, remember? And then hit it with a chain. Hold on, get close to it, hit it. So it went with them. Okay. Let's go chain going into there. Oh, and there's the big flower again. Okay. Can you shoot something? Shoot, shoot the handle? Now it's saying shoot this thing. And join it to something like a SMB. Oh, okay. Now chop the chair. Now chop it. Chop it. Just chop it as much as you can. Aha. And then that's killed all these flowers. There we go. It's the mother bird. <clears throat> Iron lock doors with B. Bind and then bind it to the Oh look, 
look, when I pull this thing now, it's pulling the lock. Okay, right there. Maybe I'll just get there on this. Oh, oh there we go. Woohoo! Oh. 3F. Oh, wait. I'm on the third floor, I guess. So is this a lift? It could only be broken. I have it. Can I use my thing in it? Oh, I can! Okay, ooh, look at this. The doors are them. Oh. Let's go in that room. I wonder if there's um. If it's in there. I hope there's nothing bad in the there. The master. The master. The masters are basically bosses. Yeah. Yes, I mean. It's boss room, doesn't it? What is that? What is that? What is that? The, the camera doesn't follow you, it sort of just switches when you go to the mirrors. What was that? It looks like it's I think it's like a typhoon mm -hmm. huge. What, what's, the, what's after the Alexa? Mm -hmm. What are all the items you have? Panacea? Panacea. Okay, we've got rid of that status yeah. effect, so that's good. I'm just going to put the medicine on the speed dial. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it has a purple bone from its head. Okay, this looks like a moss battle, doesn't it's it? Moss. It's moss. It's moss. It's moss. Okay. Aim for the purple growth on its head <laughs> every time that appears. Here we go. Oh, good I think that's what I'm hitting there. Pull back, pull back, pull back hard! Oh. Okay, that's so what I can build up tension by holding this thingy. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it's not going to be able to get through the I'm 
avoid that, avoid that, avoid it. Avoid, avoid. That's it. Oh, oh, I think I really got him. Oh, here we go. We got his thingy. Has been defeated. Oh, the chase with some power. Great. <clears throat> Level up. Okay. Oh, so what? Smash those things. And then we get home. And they do all know. Grab that one. We do all know. Okay. Is there a quick return? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. If I can just um, go back. I don't think I can. I'm going to walk back. Same. <clears throat> oh no, look. That's good. Come on, to just go back through the rooms. Okay. Can you give my girlfriend her yummy lunch? I don't think she eats it. Yeah, she does. She's good. It's like some old, like, weird guy. With master flesh. Well, then, serve it up to Elena without delay. Aaron, I'm so glad you're safe. Is this... Master Flesh. You think he'd cook it, don't you? I think she did. Maybe if you cook it, it doesn't work. <laughs> I think I'll continue because I've spent about an hour on that. I've beaten the first boss. I think I've got an idea of where it's going. What do you reckon, Dom? Good game? Yes. Okay. Well, as usual, if anyone wants to play this, then you can come into the Australian Computer Museum. Um, it's going to be on the shelf here with the Wii. And uh, yeah, as always, thanks for watching.